o'clock Sunday morning and right now we are at uh, Atlantic Times Square in Monterey Park uh, which is part of the Chinatown, the big Chinatown area and uh, today we're going to check out a dim sum place uh, the Atlantic Seafood and dim sum restaurant Normally when you come at noon time there will be a long line outside of the restaurant um, but since we arrived early today, it's about 10.30 right now, we didn't have to wait. Uh, but you can see that in the restaurant, there are already many people uh, who are eating. Um, so in this type of restaurant, this type of dim sum restaurant, um, usually people don't order the foods all at once. Instead, there are carts with different types of dim sum or different type of dishes that go around all the tables. And when you see the food that you like, you just tell them and they will grab it directly from these carts. It's quite convenient. And actually this is a way that a lot of Cantonese restaurants serve their foods uh, back in China. But if you ask, they do have a menu uh, that includes all the foods they serve. And the first dish that we ordered is this chicken feet. This is honestly my favorite dish among all the Cantonese foods. Um, it's a little salty and a little sweet, and it's cooked with this fermented soybeans. And um, there's not so much meat attached to the feet, but there's just so much collagen, and the skin is so tender and loose after the steaming process. It's just delicious. You have to order this if you go to a dim sum place. And usually people would like to have some tea with dim sum, so we ordered some chrysanthemum tea. And for the second dish, we ordered some steamed shrimp dumplings. Um, it looks not so great, um, and it's kind of loose. The, the skin just fell apart when I um, put it in my plate. Um, it does have a lot of shrimp inside, that's the good thing. Um, but I think the taste is, is just regular and it's not very impressive. The third dish that we ordered is uh, beef changfen. Uh, this is also a very traditional dim sum dish. And it usually comes with this dipping sauce. It's like soy sauce but uh, a little different. The skin of it is a little sticky and a little elastic. It goes very well with the meat inside. Um, they have, they usually have a thin layer of minced beef, and I think they do put cilantro um, with the beef. It it tastes very good. Uh, the fourth dish that we ordered is this pan-fried stuffed bell pepper. It just looks so beautiful. Um, I think the meat is shrimp. They probably have. Uh, stuffed bell pepper with some shrimp meat and steamed it or pan fried it and they do cut it for you so it's easier for a table of people to share um, the shrimp tastes uh, tastes very meaty so it's like a meatball and uh, uh, it goes very well with the pepper the, the flavor just match each, uh, with each other it's so great uh, I really like the fish so these are all the dishes that we ordered today. Uh, we don't have many people and so we can't order a lot of foods. Uh, but it will be a great experience if you have a group of people. And uh, they have a lot of options as you see uh, in the menu. And uh, I would say that the price is very reasonable. The price is actually at the low end compared to some other restaurants that I've been to. So definitely worth it. And if you do come, uh, come early. It's about 11.30 right now, and you can see how many people are waiting right now. Uh, we've been here for about an hour. We arrived at 10.30, so that's a good time to arrive. So if you're interested in exploring more restaurants, uh, subscribe to my channel. I will see you next time.